Hello Guardians, welcome back to Right Way Gaming. In the last video I showed you how to find regional chests and off the back of that I am now going to show you how to find lost sectors. Now these are pretty similar apart from they're a little bit more long winded and take a little bit more effort. But if you bring up your minimap just like I said in the last one you'll find these markers with the one for the lost sectors. Now these can be a little easier to find but also can be harder because they can be well hidden so there's two t on this area of the map so apparently there's one here so let me just I already know where the other one is but I want to find this one just to show you when you don't know where they are how easy they are to find right there it is so as you can see, it's actually marked up on the wall in the entrance that you need to be going into. Let me just kill this guy. There we go. It's a nice little chest. Another. Thank you. EDZ talking. Right, so once you've found this mark on the wall, there'll be a doorway or an entrance that you can enter that's normally well hidden or at least a little bit hidden. And it'll lead down into some form of tunnels. And you just need to follow these tunnels through. It can split off, but more than often than not, one end will go to a dead end and the other will lead to where you need to be going. So just keep following it through and eventually you'll come to a group of enemies, like so. So just literally empty them out. I mean, they're pretty easy to solo, if I'm honest, but I am level 20, and I've got like light level 200 at the moment as well, so it's not what level you might be, but it definitely makes it easier, and they're not exactly hard. Just lots of enemies, but just be careful, and you'll be fine. Yeah, we're expecting you to pop out. Uh, there's that guy. Right, so once you've killed the guy that's an elite like that, you'll see it says in the bottom left hand corner of the screen, catch codes acquired. Which basically means that a chest of pretty noticeable size will pop. So if I go down here, the ads will continue to spawn, so don't think that you can just keep fighting them and they'll clear out. They do carry on spawning. At least that's what I've found. But this is a chest. This is what it looks like. It has the Lost Sector logo on it. You open it up and you'll get a load of free gear. Now, as you can see, I've just got the Fractured Arrow Hunter Relic. If you want to know what that's for then I'll be doing a video on it later so make sure to keep an eye out for that um, but it's pretty simple really that is it for Lost Sectors so you get gear from it and you get oh that's quite nice um, why is it going on about that I don't know um, so I've got myself a decent weapon there and we got myself a new cloak not bad not bad I can get rid of that one. And did it say I got something else? It says I got a new helmet. Again, not bad. So there it is. That is it for Lost Sectors. They are pretty easy to run. They're not too difficult. And they're quite nice to just explore through sometimes. Because they can be in some pretty intriguing places. But that's it for today guys. Hope you've enjoyed watching. Don't forget to comment, subscribe and like. Let's catch you next time.